the prefrontal lobes are the portion of our brain that modulates how happy or unhappy we are. Our ability to get along with other people is a prefrontal lobe function. There's actually an area in the prefrontal lobes that allows us to be harmonious with other people. Isn't that interesting? And the prefrontal lobes are kind of this part of the brain that is this far forward, okay? So this area right here would be behind the person's forehead. The point between the eyebrows would be sort of whoop, right there. If we look at things that would stimulate the function of the prefrontal lobes, and meditation is one of the things that does it preeminently, does it beautifully, and it does it in a way that also has many other positive effects on your physiology, even your genetic makeup, you're able to begin to manifest over time much more positive behaviors and your brain begins to change and realize that what you really want is essentially to live from this point here, to live from this area of your prefrontal lobes where that becomes more your reality. Even if you just like to be happier, more creative, get along with people better, be more compassionate with other people. It turns out there's a portion of right behind the prefrontal lobe that's concerned with compassion. So it's not surprising when people meditate regularly that they begin to find they're kinder, that they have an interest in other people. They become empathetic in ways that they didn't think they would ever be able to do and actually feel what other people are feeling. When I've had a very good meditation in the morning and I go in to practice medicine, it is so much easier for me. Our ability to be different, our ability to, be, to change is really available to everyone. And remember your brain, your nervous system, your genetic material, all these aspects of your physical body are actually designed to cooperate with this transformation.